to my channel. Today I'm so excited to be doing my closet tour for you guys and this is something that has been requested quite a bit and I'm so excited to be here to film it for you guys because I absolutely love my closet. I pretty much live in here and it was built by California Closets. So I will go ahead and link their information down below. As always, any info that you're looking for, you can find in the description box. And if you have any specific questions, go ahead and write me a comment and I will get back to you guys. But if you're excited to see what is in my closet and my closet tour, make sure you give this video a thumbs up so that I know you guys enjoy my videos and enjoy watching these kinds of videos. And subscribe down below because I will be doing a purse collection and shoe collection very soon and I would love to have you guys here on my channel. So let's get into the closet. Alright, so this is what my closet looks like as you walk in from the hallway into the room. And I do have the blinds closed right now because it's storming and I didn't want to ruin the mood, you know. So right now, I have my vanity set up. It's quite messy, but I can't really film in front of it because there's not enough room to put the ring light. But I do like to do my makeup in here when I'm not filming it. And then I have... My ring light and my tripod set up facing this way so this is what you guys see from my videos and I'll just go ahead and step back to give you an overview of the closet. So this chair is what I sit in to film and I absolutely love it and then I have my initials on my blanket right there and then this is actually where I edit most of my videos and it's just a little desktop workspace. It's pretty clean. Um, I guess you could say I don't uh, spend a lot of time sitting there because I really like to edit in my bed mostly. So I actually just wanted to refilm this area really quickly because I've kind of got it more set up to my liking since I filmed the closet tour, but right here I've got my white cedar candle, my Victor Rolf flower bomb, which is my current favorite, and the rest of my perfumes are still kind of packed up, and then I've got this really cute little sand glass with shells in it, and then down here I've got some goodies, so I've got my Killian perfume. I absolutely love Killian and everything is so creative and you can tell that there's so much investment into each piece but this scent is water calligraphy and they come in just the most beautiful packaging and of course I love the K for Kylan <laughs> or Killian and then I've got some of my phone cases back here. These are just the ones that I have out right now but I've got my Kimoji one, my Sonics one, my Velvet Caviar, Instagram made me buy it, <laughs> um, rose gold and marble. And then this one is from a brand called Decoded and I like that it has like a little card slot but it's not as like obvious. And then I also have this Lumi case right here and this is the duo in matte black. So that's really nice when I'm taking makeup photos. And then I have this Edie Parker clutch, it's beautiful. It's got like this really pretty detailing, but it's like a smooth, hard case. And it just pops open like that, and you can keep all your little goodies in there. So I absolutely love that. And then I also have some little Ray-Bans in this cute little thing here. Now this tray is actually what I wanted to show you guys because I actually found all my sunglasses that were packed away and put them in here so the tray doesn't look so dull. But I've got Dior on Dior in this middle section. So I've got the original So Reels, the Tortoise, the Gold, the Gray Leather and Tortoise. And then some of my favorites right now, these are the uh, Rose Gold Aviators. And then over here, I've got these that I got in Taiwan. They're very cute. And then these are Fendi. And then I've just got a couple more pairs of Ray-Bans. Um, that are like more... They're older and a little bit more nostalgic. But this section just like really has me feeling some type of way. So I love it. 
And then this is my jewelry drawer. So in here, I don't have all of my jewelry yet, but I do have some of my favorite pieces in here. This is a Texas bracelet that I got from my god sister that's so cute. And um, just miscellaneous. It also comes with another jewelry drawer on top. I need to move all of my jewelry into here. And as you guys know, I wear uh, quite a bit of jewelry like every day. So, um, and I have my favorite necklace on right now. So, it doesn't switch up too much. But I've got some wallets in here. So I've got two Louis ones, a uh, Mui Mui one, and then this Kate Spade clutch. And my sister actually makes fun of me because I don't use wallets. It's like a thing. I just use like a little wallet, if you will. It's just like a tiny little um, keychain wallet. And then I have all of my leggings in here. A um, majority of these are Lulu. And um, they're just little like sweatpants and leggings and such and I don't really have much use for that drawer now because it's summer but this drawer is all of my shorts so and I have like little skirts from Lulu um yeah I think I have some Lulu scarves sitting there and then these are just all my different I think these are the speed shorts those are my favorite ones and then I also have some of like this style that ties and it's like a little bit cuter and then I have my jean shorts in the back it's a tiny section it's quite sad um, but I do have my favorite pair which are these and these are from Aritzia in New York and they're just the brand Tallulah and I just love them they're little ripped jean shorts and these drawers do like soft clothes so they don't ever slam and um, if you can tell this is like a leather material that makes the drawers and then just right here I've got a pull out mirror and so if I'm trying on an outfit or something and I want to see it, I can do that. However, I did bring my mirror from my room if you guys watch some of my vlogs. So I don't necessarily have a lot of use for this one, but if there's someone in here with me or whatever, um, you know, it's nice to have mirrors. And then here I've got, I've got six shelves with all of my bags. So I've got my Celine's, I've got a YSL there, and all of my purses. I put the two blue ones together. I love this tiny little patent leather Chanel. It's so cute. And I've got a Chloe here, and I love those. And I'll be coming out with a purse collection in depth, but... I'll also be doing a shoe collection, so I will just kind of show you guys the organization. I've got brown boots and then my YSL kind of suede high top sandals. They're not sitting up correctly, but that's that row, mostly riding boots. Then I've got booties. So I have my, I think these are, these are Jimmy Choo's. And I wore those for my one year and I loved them. And then I've got Aquazura. These are just some of my little booties. And I absolutely love these Valentino booties too. And then I've got a random pair of YSL slides. And then some more kind of like high top booty type shoes. Then it gets into some heels, so got nude heels, and these are some of my favorites for summer right now. They're like that platform type sandal, and those are Burberry. And I've got more heels, and these are some little Valentino ballet flats. And then it gets into flats there. And then sandals and you can tell I have a love for sandals so these are some of my favorites those are YSL black sandals and then slides 
And actually, I think my mom's slides are in here as well, but those are the same pair that are up there, so I need to take those down to her. And then some colorful flats, and then my brown nude YSL sandals, and these are the same as the black ones that you saw up here. And I love, love, love those. Especially for summer, they just have a really cute vibe to them. And then, you can kind of tell as you go across, it's mostly boots. So, these are black boots and booties. And those are high top Jimmy Choo's. I've got some Valentino's and Chloe's. I love them. And then I get into black heels. And then these are some of my absolute fave for winter. These are some black Prada booties that I love. And these are my favorite. These are so comfortable, you guys. These are the Valentino, like, traditional um, heeled sandal with the studs. And I love them. I've got my Aqua Zoras that I also love. They're like a fuzzy heel. And then silver heels, some more flats, and slip-on shoes. These are my Vents ones. I love the Vents slip-ons. And then I think these are, those are Chloe with the typical scallops. And then I've got more black sandals here. These are new. These are some Vince sandals, and I know they're a little bit different, but I like them a lot. And then I have, these are Sergio Rossi, and then some miscellaneous sandals. Those are Jimmy Choo's. And then I've got my cowboy boots and my Aquazura knee highs. Of course, TBT to the UGG days. I kind of like just have them as keepsakes, you guys. It's, don't, don't hold it against me. And these are my black and white Adidas that my boyfriend got me. And they have my initials and then my favorite number. And I'm obsessed with them. They're so cute. I've got the original Adidas Yeezys. Um, other tennis shoes. These are my favorite Chanel flower tennis shoes. These are Adidas. And some more tennis shoes. It's a little cray. These are my Gucci ones that my boyfriend got me as well. They're just so adorable. And then... I'm tripping over this ladder, but I've got the rest of my slip-on shoes and tennis shoes and kind of more athletic kind of shoes at the bottom. Those are the Nikes. And then I've got my other two pairs of Yeezys. These ones and these. And these are really cute, like summer color. And then I have this ladder. It's really cute. It just like reminds me of a movie. I don't know why, but I instead of thinking of like a closet, I always think of the mail scene in The Grinch. I really don't know why. It's so weird, but it just moves like that. And then I've got the rest of my purses. I have my absolute favorite Louis up there out of my reach. And then my Saint Laurent. My Louis Clutch. If you guys can't tell, I have an issue with Louis and Chanel. And then some backpacks. This is a Brunello. And the one on the left is a Louis. And then my smaller clutch type purses are up there. And then I've got another backpack and suitcase. And then this fringe Louis and this Chloe like tiny, tiny purse. And then starting here, I have all of my nicer dresses. So I have my prom dress here, it was lavender. Um, I love it, I had it custom made for me and it's beautiful. And so it's just kind of a keepsake. And then a bunch of other little dresses. This dress is so cute. I haven't gotten a chance to wear it yet, but I love it. And then here I've got some little cute pairs of shorts and mostly white little tops. And white tops are my favorite. 
And then I've got all of my pants slash jeans. And I've got frame. You guys know I love my frame ripped jeans. And I believe these are frame as well. Um, I literally like just took them off the hanger. LOL. And then I've got some sweaters and jackets. Um, these are like coats and stuff. I think I'm going to move these out and go ahead and put more like summery dresses and clothes because I don't have room for them. So I like, you know, it's summer and I want to wear them. So I'm going to rotate these out. And then I've got black tops and mixed in rompers like this romper that I wore for New Year's. It's so cute. And then little cute tops and then I've got like my nude leather jacket and then this light jacket that would be cute for summer as well. Over there I just have hats. So that is my closet in a nutshell and I hope you guys enjoyed. All right guys, so that was my closet tour. I hope you guys enjoyed. I will hopefully be doing a shoe collection separately and then a purse collection following that. So make sure that you guys stay tuned, subscribe down below, give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed and I will see you in my next video.